welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to check out my social media channels. In today's video, I will be showing you three easy ways to speed up Windows 10 without the need of downloading any software. To start off with, all you need to do is go down to the bottom left hand corner of your computer and type in disk and you now need to open up disk cleanup. You now need to select your C drive and press OK. We now need to click on clean up system files and press our C drive again and it will begin to load. Once it has finished loading, we will have a few options to select. You now need to go through this list and select what you would like to remove. For example, if your computer has been running absolutely fine since doing any Windows updates, then you can select the first option and you can select the second option. And that will remove any files that we use to do some Windows updates. You can also delete your downloaded program files. You can definitely delete temporary internet files. We can select Windows error reports. You've got DirectX shader cache we can remove. Delivery optimization files. Basically just go through the list and select what you would like to remove from your computer. Obviously just be careful if you're going to delete your recycle bin. Just in case you have some files in there that you do actually want to restore. Once you are happy with your selection, you can go ahead and press OK. Just remember this will permanently delete the files from your computer. Once this cleanup has finished, the next thing to do is go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen again and right click on the start menu. You now need to click on task manager. And we now need to go across to startup. And here is a list of all the programs that boot up when Windows first logs on. For example, Discord is currently disabled, but previously it would have loaded up with Windows. And this would have had a slight impact on how fast Windows boots up. And then also how fast Windows is when it's currently running. Because the more software you have running while you're using Windows, the slower your computer. For example, Java Update Scheduler, I don't need that to load when I boot up Windows, I can disable that. And as you can see on the right hand side, Windows are very clever and they do have a startup impact here, which kind of tells you how much of an impact it has on your computer. Once you have gone through all that list of the programs that you have and disabled what you don't need, just bearing in mind, don't disable any antivirus or anything like that security wise because you do want to stay nice and safe. Once you have done all that, we can then close down Task Manager and you now need to go back down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and type in defrag. You now need to click on defragment and optimize drives and you now need to click on optimize on your C drive. And there we go, straight away that's finished. Basically optimizing your drives will rearrange files just to make your Windows boot up faster and run a lot faster. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social channels.